Welcome to the best day of my life. Let's start this day. Look at my coffee, all excited to see me. He's like, oh, what's up, Chrome? <laughs> Whoa, okay, I just passed a building covered in graffiti. So we're gonna bust a U-turn up here and go back and check it out. First time I've seen some rad graffiti since I've been out here on the island. Ah, so excited. We all know that I like graffiti, but when there's a place where it's gated, ugh, but you can still sneak in, eh, I'm gonna go check this place out. This is dope. What? <laughs> awesome. I love this stuff. Just so wicked. I'm not sure what this place used to be. It looks like it might have been a mill. I would have said like a slaughterhouse because of that stuff there, but there's some stuff over there that looks like it. This might have been just an old mill. Everything's boarded up and locked up, but man, it would be so cool to get in there. I bet you they've graffitied the whole inside of it too. Ha! Glad I found this. This totally made my day. the most old world sort of, I don't know how to explain it. It's beautiful. But anyway, we found some more graffiti. Damn, I love all this wall art. <laughs> awesome. So we're here in Victoria and we're not going to be here very long. We're sitting on the front doorsteps of what would be like the White House of BC. This huge building here is where they make all the decisions, all the government stuff happens right in here. Yep, Disco has pissed on this building like probably three times already. Could you guys sit on the front doorsteps of your major government building? Come on, Disco, cross the line. This says don't cross to see if you get some trouble. Go cross. Go cross it. Victoria is an amazing place. It is beautiful and lots of old style buildings, much like these ones spread all over town, old school hotels, super, super, super cool. You know, even the security guards that stand here and guard this great government building are so awesome. We could probably high five them. I'm not kidding you. Look at that, standing down there, gut in hand. We could totally high five them when we leave. 
Let's go do that. Really not too sure if we're gonna stick around or not. Weather's not looking like overly great. You coming, homie? Oh yeah, security. High five! <laughs> High five, Disco! <laughs> See you later. Have a nice day. See ya. Okay. Oh. Okay, don't poop on the lawn. <laughs> Pee on everything, just don't poop on the lawn. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> See, Canada, things aren't like they are in other places of the world. Even the gun-holding security guards are super awesome. That would have been funny if Disco was like, yep, I'm taking a poop right here on the front doorsteps of the Parliament building. All right. <laughs> ah, another good day. Yep, we're back at the ferry. I know we're leaving a little bit earlier than I expected, but the purpose of this trip was to break the creative side in me that was feeling a little bit trapped and just kind of just uncreative being in the place that I was born and raised in, in Vancouver. And, you know, I needed to see something different, something to kind of spark some excitement for me. And I got that on my drive over here and to Tofino. Tofino was just on freaking believable and exactly what I needed. And on the way back from, from Tofino, driving through the island, it was pretty, but it was rainy most of the drive. And uh, we got to Victoria today, and as much as Victoria is beautiful, I've seen this place so many times. I know I probably should have stuck around for another day to get you all some amazing footage of this beautiful place, but we'll do that, I don't know, another day when it's nicer out. The weather's supposed to get pretty crappy and really cold in the next few days. We're getting a bit of a, a winter chill coming through. So I decided that we were just gonna go back to the ferry. There was nothing really holding me here in Victoria, so I said, you know what? Let's just go back home and I just finished texting my daughter and said, uh, hey, excuse me, do you wanna go to the aquarium tomorrow? She was like, yes! So I'm picking my daughter up tomorrow morning and her and I are gonna go to the aquarium. Don't worry, we'll take you all with us, that's for sure. But, it was really hard to leave Tofino, let me tell you that, man. Tofino was, ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah. 